Hey everyone, this is JB here in this video. Welcome to the channel. Today, I'll be teaching you how to put music on your iPhones without the use of lightning wires, lightning connector. So stay tuned. videos for quite some times because my account got numerous strikes. When I mean numerous, it's more than three strikes. I'm not really sure what happened, but some of the videos, some of my tutorial videos were tagged as dangerous. And that made me less enthusiastic on making videos here in my channel, but right now I am trying to get back on track and I will be creating videos again here in Tech Guy PH. Now for today, I will be teaching you how to put music on your iPhone without the use of the lightning connector. Yes, without the use of any wires. So you might be thinking, okay, is it the same video that JB made a few years ago? Yes, it is, but this one is quite just an update. And in here, I'm not gonna teach you how to pirate music over the internet, okay? <laughs> All right. Now, there are two methods that I will be teaching you today. First is over the air, or yeah, we're gonna download some music over the internet. And the next method is gonna be with a computer, but we're not gonna connect our iPhones to the computer using the lightning connector or with the use of iTunes. We're not gonna use that today. Now, let's move on to the first method, over the air. So let's move on to our iPhones right here. The first thing we have to do is to download an app called Ever Music. Now go to your app store, find Ever Music, and there should be one app there that is in blue icon. This one, download that. Just wait for it to finish. I haven't downloaded this one for quite some time because I have the paid ver version of Ever Music. All right, now, you may open it if you want. Yes, we're gonna open it. And you will be directed to this um, pane right here. Yeah, you can read all of that if you want. All right, we're gonna skip this step right here. And yeah, so let me just give you a quick rundown on what's inside this app here. We have the playlist pane for the page. We have the music page. We have the connect page, files page and the settings, all right. So next step is go to your settings menu, all right, and find Safari, all right. Let's just find Safari right here and go to downloads. Now, what I want you to do is to change downloads to a folder. Find the folder that says Ever Music, all right. So this one, Ever Music and click on downloads. All right, so we're done with that step. Why I wanted you to change that. If you want to download just audio files, just use this method. And if you want to download other files other than music, just change your downloads folder to the regular one, all right? Okay, off to the next step right here. What I want you to do is basically just try to Google how to download music on the internet and you will find a bunch of websites where you can download free music or free audios. Now in my case, I am subscribed to Artlist. And let me just sign in real quick here. Okay, that's my personal account, all right. And I'm gonna download one music right here. So okay, let me just try to download air. All right, MP3. And it will ask me to view or download. Obviously, I'm just gonna pick on download, right? And in here, you will see that it's downloaded already. It's gonna be in my downloads file, right? Now, if you downloaded your songs off the internet on your Safari browser, go to Ever Music app, all right? In this case, I'm just gonna move this um, icon right here to my, yeah, to my home screen, all right? And I'm gonna click on Ever Music. I'm gonna go to Files, and I'm gonna go to Downloads. 
And that specific music that we've downloaded off from the Safari is now listed here in the downloads. Uh, I mean, in the downloads folder of the app. Okay, just click on that and it's going to start playing. Yeah, it's actually playing right now. I'm sorry, why is my volume too low? Yeah, you get the idea. So that is the first method and how to put music on your iPhone over the air or when you try to download things or audio from the internet. <laughs> Alrighty. Alright, we're moving on to the next method right here with the use of your computer, your Mac or PC. Now first is go to your Ever Music app, alright? But make sure that your computer and your phone is connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Alright, so in here we have this page called connect right yeah and now at the bottom of this like page it ha it says here wi-fi drive just click on that and you have the option here to put your username and password and start wi-fi drive but it's kind of optional but for security purposes i'm just gonna put some username in it like my name or yeah that's my name actually it's janet blake my password is one, two, and three. All right. Now I'm going to start Wi-Fi drive. Okay. Every music would like to find and connect to devices in your local network. Just hit OK. Now it will give you certain URL in here. Now it says here, enter this URL in web browser. So we're going to go to our computer and open any web browser of your preference. I'm just going to put here 192 dot one six eight dot eight dot one five zero and it's gonna ask me for the username and password so i place there blake and that's one two three and i'm gonna hit on sign in right and no we're not gonna save that password right there now what we what we're seeing here right now in my computer is that this is um, the access to our Ever Music app, which is basically wireless, all right? Now, in here we have some folders. If we try to click on some folders right here, like for example, downloads, it's gonna, it's gonna show up some of the music that we have on the downloads folder inside our Ever Music app. Now, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna upload some of the music that I have on my computer. All right, so I'm just gonna click on upload and I'm going to go to my desktop because I have some music right there and I'm just going to try to select all of them and click on open. All right. And it's going to transfer those music files to my phone, to my ever music app on my phone. All right. So just wait for it. It's going to take for quite some time, depending on your internet access, but yeah, I got a fairly not good amount of internet um, speed right now because maybe because of the weather or whatnot. So I'm just going to wait for it to finish. All right. And just one more. And everything is done. Now, if you're finished transferring music or uploading music off the if you're done transferring music using the um, computer browser, just stop the Wi-Fi drive, all right? And basically, if you try to um, try to pull that again, it will not be able to um, show the items inside your app. All right, now let's go back here. Now, the next step is gonna be um, the files, uh, the files. Now, all the music that we have uploaded from the web browser is listed here inside our Ever Music app. All right, so let's just play some of it. Well, I'm not sure why this really sounds so low. Yeah, like this one. <laughs> okay, so basically you got the idea on how to transfer music off from the internet and from our computer without the use of the lightning connector 
or the wired method. So I think that would be all for today. I hope that I've helped you in one way or another. All right, this is JB here in this video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of the day.